At KubeCon Chicago, David Eads talked about how core Kubernetes and Kubernetes ecosystem work together to foster the development of new workloads. In Paris, Fabian and Mike talked about how virtual machines can run on a cluster alongside containers. And today, we want to talk about extending workloads to other cloud-native environments, and not only, that is not only within Kubernetes cluster, which is why today we are announcing our intent to contribute a comprehensive set of container tools to CNCF. Which means Podman and Bootsy are coming, coming home. home. Thank you. With more than 23,000 stars, thousands of users, and years in production use, Podman is recognized for its security, robustness, and innovations. From its inception, Podman was designed with, with keen awareness of Kubernetes and its leading role in the cloud. Podman stands for Pod Manager. And as you know, pods are the smallest deployable unit in Kubernetes. Yes, Podman loves Kubernetes. Podman Desktop is a user-friendly GUI for managing pods, containers, and working with Kubernetes on your laptop. It simplifies the configuration of container tools, providing developers simplistic onboarding for all of your container development needs. With more than 1.5 million downloads used by thousands of developers like you. And next, I'm excited to introduce Bootsy. And because I am very creative with naming projects, it stands for Boot Container. With Bootsy, you build your operating system using standard container tools and then deploy and upgrade it in place with Bootsy. This lets containers go beyond applications and gives us a cloud-native experience for operating systems that works across bare metal and virtualization. In this demo, we're building a container image that will be bootable via Bootsy. The base image already includes a kernel, and with this, we're able to use standard container build tools to build on top. Now, I want to emphasize that Bootsy provides very sophisticated and rich control over the operating system, such as configuring kernel arguments and, for example, what we call logically bound images to roll out agent and system workloads. This uses Podman's great integration with systemd and ties it to Bootsy's transactional in-place updates. Here you can see our system is booted into Bootsy, and we have that agent container running that's upgraded alongside the OS. Now you may be asking, how did we get here? How are containers bootable? Well, come talk to us in the booth after about that. In this demo, we're going to dive into how day two updates work. The scenario is our security team found some issues in a scan. We need to turn off hyperthreading and update our agent container, among other things. In our GitOps repo, we make the needed changes. Notice how kernel arguments can be configured through drop-in TOML files. We updated that agent container, git commit, and git push, and that's going to start the rollout of our updated container to the registry. This is showing the CLI in the deployed system. Now, in production, of course, you'd likely have an agent controlling no drain or rollout, or your orchestration. But you can see here, we only needed to fetch the changed configuration layers not an entirely new OS image. After our update is applied, you can see that with Bootsy, we have AB-style updates with rollback. Our kernel argument is applied alongside the other changes. And in the end, we took care of what the security team needed using just our knowledge of container builds. Wow, that was awesome. Podman builds an OS image and pushes the image to an, uh, the same OCI container registry where you currently store your applications. Then your CICD system can test, security scan, and sign your operating system image um, and preserve. Um, then fleets can automatically download the new container images and update the operating system, preserving the OS data. All this can be automated using tools like Tektron and other cloud native tools to update. This contribution is part of Red Hat's commitment to fully free and open source software. Try out Podman Desktop today like millions of others have. Podman is available on every Linux distribution as well as on Macs and Windows. Use Bootsy and Podman to design and manage your operating system in a cloud-native fashion. 
as an appliance everywhere. At 12.30 today, come to the Red Hat booth and I will be signing, giving away free signed copies of my book, Podman in Action. Come find us at the Project Pavilion, wearing our Bootsy glasses, at the cryo, cryo booth. Um, we'd love to collaborate and work together. Thank you. Thank you.